Well, it's been a week thanks in no part to my ISP deciding to shut itself all over the floor in its own hair and in its own eyes. And as frustrating as all of that has been for moi, I have still been able to at least keep up with all things Gamergate and anti-ESG while my internet was slowly dying. One thing that I have been desperate to cover for you guys and have a good laugh with you about is this whole Stellar Blade fiasco's latest development where a bunch of woke feminist activist trashbag journalist scumbags from IGN decided to have a big old go at, uh, well, Korea. Well, not exactly Korea, but basically just trying to say that a bit of digital TNA is somehow completely and totally unrealistic. The argument, as always, from the feminists of the world's leading country of obesity and anti-beauty is that women in video games who have slim waists, uh, let's say well-proportioned chesticles and peachy buttocks are completely and totally divorced from any realistic expectations that you may be able to have about a female body. This, of course, is completely ridiculous, as any person like me living in Asia, especially people who live in Korea or Japan, will be able to tell you that the women in Asia are still very much into their femininity. They don't particularly appreciate it when T people take over their Miss Universe pageant, for example, and uh, they check out of the mortal realm a lot happier here than the uh, screeching, reeing harpies of the West tend to. If you don't believe me, well, we're going to check it out anyway because Maxim Korea has decided to defend Shin Jae-un, the model whose body was used to generate Eve for Stellar Blade, and laugh at the feminist attempts to call them unrealistic. You want to see it. Hello, welcome back to Will of the Fans. My name is Will. See what I did there? Hope you're having a lovely, lovely day. Boy, it's good to be back. I hate it when almost every single month at the moment something gets in the way of me being able to just bloody record videos and go live and talk to you guys. Thank you so much to the numerous people who have chimed in my comments and, and told me that you're happy to wait and that you're still watching my stuff and enjoying it and you can't wait for me to come back and do lives and stuff. It really means the world to me. So thank you very, very much. So let's have a laugh, shall we? We're going to watch this Maxim Korea video. Maxim, as you may know, is a men's magazine. And the Korean one, unsurprisingly, has a lot of Korean models in it. So they are well versed with Shin Jae-un and her work. And they have decided that uh, they're sick and tired of hearing that the beauty that they work so hard to maintain and perfect is unrealistic because a bunch of fat, ugly, lazy, slovenly, hairy bitches in America can't handle the existence of naturally and through tenacity beautiful women so if you're liking the video like the video and don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to support me make sure you don't miss out on any more news reviews commentary and rebellion here we go then maxim korea with a nice little news piece where we will uh, attend to the accusations of unrealistic beauty let's do it maxim news a recent individual, uh, sorry, incident where an individual was criticized for an unrealistic body type. Yes, that's right. This has actually made it all the way to Korea. And that's South Korea, Ryan, okay? Obviously. IGN France, she says with a smile on her face. And I don't know if you've noticed this, but this uh, newsreader, she don't look that different from Eve either. She's got a nice slim waist, nice hips, and uh, up top, plenty going on up there as well. Um, if you look at Korean pop groups, such as Blackpink or Stella, of course, that name, uh, and also, uh, I don't know, Momoland or any of those guys, or girls rather. What you're going to find very quickly is that they are all very similar in body shape. Very similar indeed. And uh, that, that body type is uh, the one that is owned and uh, used and utilized here by Eve in Stellar Blade. Congratulations, Grums. You are officially on Korean news. Well done. 
<laughs> the character appears bland, like a doll created with exaggerated sexual aspect by someone who's never seen a woman. That is what IGN said. And now you've created an international incident, IGN. Well done. Well done. I hope you're really proud of yourself. This guy should have been fired. The editor-in-chief, of course, lost his mind as well about what they call hypersexualization. No, mate. It's called nature. Yeah, fuck with. Right. As some of you may know, the character Eve in this game was modeled after Shin Jae-eun, a Maxim cover model. Can a character modeled after a real person's body be called unrealistic? <laughs> <laughs> this poor woman, this, she has to read this, and, and you know, as soon as the cameras roll, she's like, wow, I didn't know the French were such bigots. <laughs> she's like, why am I having to read this? This retarded... I mean, her body's not that different from the models. She, she's looking in the mirror thinking, am I not real? Of course not. No, this just goes to show, obviously, categorically, how... Totally divorced from reality, modern leftist, wokist, progressivist, feminist, activist scum have become. They don't live in reality. They have no right, no clout, no weight to their words whatsoever. No business discussing what is or is not reality. And I think we all know at least five or ten good reasons why. But uh, let's focus on this one a bit more. Of course, there's uh, Shin jae being scanned. Does this make sense? No, it does not make sense. And thank you for raising this. This is fantastic because you know a lot of guys in Korea. Um, they come over here to the Philippines. They travel all over the world. And um, you got to think that when their national culture is being attacked... Because of a bunch of woke fucking idiots in France and America and Canada and all the other, my country too, in, in England. Yeah, they're, they're just going to go, what's wrong with these people? It's the same as Japan. It's the same as I said when I was talking about uh, the Visions of Mana director who was saying we are not going to pander to Western communist sensibilities. We're going to have pretty women, thanks. Therefore, to educate that Shin Jae-on's body is indeed realistic and exists in reality, <laughs> we've decided to re-release the video of Shin Jae-on's photo shoot. It's a video previously released on YouTube, but this time it's made available with subtitles in English, Japanese, Arabic, Indonesian, Vietnamese, and Hindi so that people worldwide can watch it. This is such a sarcastic video from the Koreans. Don't worry, you foolish, idiotic Western peasants. With your insane communist Marxist ideology. Allow us to please demonstrate for you in your own languages, although I know his French isn't one of them, <laughs> how it is possible for a woman to be beautiful. <laughs> you get the picture. So basically, watch the full video at Maxim Korea. Also, uh, you can watch the full video that they are referencing. Uh, or referring to rather when they talk about re-releasing the Shin Jae-eun photo shoot with subtitles in English. You can find that, you can watch that. This is amazing because it represents not just um, a sarcastic, sardonic backlash to the frankly, like, extremely um, insensitive way that IGN France with their ideology just try to bulldoze through Korean culture. It represents um, the fact that when news of this insanity 
gets to the people who are not from the countries that are consumed with this insanity, it gets outed all the more clearly and quickly as insanity. This is why it's fantastic that this happened. Because the Koreans are going, fucking what? What's their problem? She's hot. <laughs> you know, like, what? No, of course. And it just goes um, further to snap people in the West out of the malaise of political correctness. And remember that there used to be a reality that we all shared. For half of us were brainwashed by Marxism. And it's just fantastic to see. I love to see this. I love to see reality come back and just slap these people in the face. Reality or other cultures, their own racism, just, just, just boof in the face and say, hey, you, we don't give a crap what you think. Shut up. Beautiful. Love to see it. Let me know what you think about it in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like the video if you've enjoyed it. And of course, subscribe to Will of the Fans if you'd like to see more of me. I'd like to see more of you. I'll be back with another video for you very, very, very soon. Yes, the internet is working. So I will be back very soon. But until then, remember to question everything. Don't forget to, of course, respect the fans. And I will chat to you next time.